Hi. What we have in front of us on the screen are thermal images of before and after treatment using the ENAR. The client presented with a, a very sore neck, limited range of movement, uh, which he's had for a long time, so a chronic condition. And the thermal image here on the left really illustrates that. It's actually a heat map of the body. It show, The white areas show a lot of heat, uh, therefore could indicate problems. And the, also the red areas also demonstrated a lot of maybe inflammation. We could interpret it as inflammation. Uh, we always treat the client uh, from top to bottom, that is from below the hairline down to the base of the spine. It's called uh, cranial, meaning the cranium in the head, or down to the base of the spine. So we spent about 15 minutes brushing these areas and the aim is to brush or, or work on the areas and using a, a little bit like a massage tool to actually clear the area and when I say clear what we mean is the stickiness recedes and also often the client's range of movement improves and this is what we experience with this client. There's a major plexus of nerves that comes out from here and it's called the brachial plexus, but it's really, uh, again, key nervous pathways down to the arm, to the fingers, to the elbow. So anyone with something like carpal tunnel, um, tennis elbow, RSI, uh, if you just treat it around the neck area, you'd probably get enormous relief. In fact, often you don't need to treat the area locally. Sometimes we do, but often we don't. And this really demonstrated it rather well, the shift between the right and the left image before and after treatment. What we had the next day, the client came in the following morning. We took the second thermal image, which is here on the right, and you can already see, you can see very clearly the redness and the whiteness around that, especially the white has completely disappeared and in effect the stickiness on the client's neck was very, very strong there. Obviously the next treatment we need to do is to have a look at the lower back area. It's white again and, and red on the pretreatment scan so we would treat uh, the sticky spot or the sticky areas that the ENA indicated and we would brush that area. We would use the device like a, a massage tool on the one or two key points around that lumbar area and again we'd expect to see it change.